More than 100 residents packed the Carlton Park Community Club on Wednesday. They came to hear an information session put on by the city about a proposed annexation of more than 330 acres of land south of Marquis Road. The city wants to use a portion of it for light industrial development. According to city manager Robert Cotterell, it's one of the last locations available to the city at a reasonable price. This made sense to us because we asked ourselves the question, where is the nearest servicing that we could do conventional design without having to put millions into servicing. As soon as you throw millions, then the cost of the land is so high that people will go other places. Okay. Residents, however, were not concerned with the growth of their city so much as keeping their neighborhood quiet and residential. I will bet you that 85% or more of the people here are dead against this. You're, you're saying two different things, and you're really changing our I think probably there is a better place right now, and that's the southwest corner of uh, the city of Prince Albert. It seems to me that if you gave more information to people that there are alternative places for this based on costing, you'd have some understanding. But at the end of the day, I think people would still like to see this area remain residential. City staff took down the suggestions and concerns faithfully, but Cotterell reminded everyone that the city was growing and it had to happen somewhere. Like it or not, we are the hub, the, the gateway, and we are the drawing force for somewhere they say about 140,000 people. And 140,000 people want to come to this city to do its commerce. And so, is that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't know. It's your community. I'm city plans on using the suggestions from the meeting for a report to council. It'll be up to them to decide what, if anything, to do with the land, but it won't go before council again until early next year. In Prince Albert, I'm Andrew D'Souza.